Welcome to the 51st issue of the Horseman's Gazette, a quarterly video series that enables you to watch and learn from some of the most talented horsewomen and men working with horses today. Learning horsemanship is a lifelong challenge. You can watch the same footage of a horse being worked and see something astounding every time. This video series enables you to be the ultimate spectator with the ability to watch and re-watch some of the best horsemen and women teach, ride, and train. Take all the time you need to learn everything you can from what we've captured on film. We hope that you use these lessons to help you become the best horsewoman or man that you can be. Come along for the ride. You and your horse will be glad that you did. The Vaquero style of riding and training horses can seem overwhelming, especially if you're not familiar with the gear being used. In this segment, Martin Black discusses the fit and function of both the hackamore and the spade bit. Understanding how these pieces of traditional equipment are designed to work is essential before you would use them on your horse. In this segment, we had the opportunity to film at a clinic where Brian Newbert was helping a horse that was really tight and bothered. Watch as Brian demonstrates some things that you can do with a tight horse that can help them be more comfortable. Having your horse prepared for the farrier can help it be a positive experience for everyone involved. In this segment, you have the wisdom and experience of two incredible horsemen demonstrating and discussing what picking up the feet means to a horse and strategies for helping that horse be comfortable having his feet handled. Whether you're trail riding for pleasure or competition, knowing that you're prepared for obstacles you may encounter will give you and your horse confidence. In this segment, Amy Lasatz outlines how to prepare a horse for the slicker, on the ground, and then under saddle, so that you'll be ready when the rain starts falling. Tom Dorrance used to say that a mule is like a horse, only more so. In that spirit, we're thrilled to have our first segments featuring mules with instruction from Ty Evans. In this segment, Ty demonstrates how to improve the turnaround with several exercises that address both the physical and mental aspects of the maneuver. 